Hello, a very good evening from one lovely show to another. I'm sure that's what we're going to expect with the launch of a brand new one day special, of course. We can welcome Kleina Palmer back. It's ages since I've worked with, with Kleina as well. In fact, shall we say a very good evening to Kleina right now. Kleina, it's lovely to have you back here at the craft store. Oh, it's lovely to be back. Amazing. When were you last here? Oh, it's been a couple of months, I think. Has it? Yeah. It just seems absolutely ages since I've seen you. I think you must have been in on the other shift, so yeah. we kind of crossed over. I think a so. I've not bit. seen you for a while. Yeah, so I'm really excited about well, this. Well, I see you on TV all the time, of course. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, it's nice to know you do watch when you're not here, Clayton. That's Indeed. lovely. Right, what I can say about this collection as well, these are absolutely beautiful. There's something a little bit different as well. I mean, we love our dyes, don't we? We love our florals, but we've got tropical collections for you here. So, very, very different. I've already picked out a perfect personal favourite item or element from these sets as well. Now for the one day special there's actually 29 dies in the whole collection there. The first set we're going to look at, you can make birds of paradise, lobster claw and you've got the banana leaf in there as well. Of course we're going to see more in the way of samples as we go along and that will make a lot more sense but you can see the thought that's gone in behind these. Now the next selection we've got for you is passion flower, oh they're beautiful as well. The Passion leaf is there as well, and the fan palm. Beautiful. You can see you've even got the little stamens for the centre of the flowers there. Again, this will all make more sense when you see the samples and demonstrations. And then finally, oh, a beautiful flower, one of my favourites actually, hibiscus. You've got the flamingo flower and the Swiss cheese leaf. Now, I did say I've picked out a favourite element out of these dyes, and it's a Swiss leaf. I just love it. Let me show you some more samples here. I mean, keeping it very simple with a tag, but how effective is that? That's using two of the different dyes there. This one here, this is the passion flower, I believe, with those beautiful leaves behind there. Do you know, I'm thinking straight away, garden parties, you know, summer, cocktails on the lawn. Maybe if you are able to get away or maybe there's a wedding abroad or something like that, these would come in very, very well as well. They're just cheerful, they're bright, they are beautiful. Absolutely gorgeous. I wonder if we could just have a look at the sample we've got at the front here as well, because I know Clayton has got a lovely couple of uh, ladies who help her with the samples. Just to show with the frame that's at the side here, even though we do have kind of a tropical theme, we'll show you the frame in a second. Then, was it Claire? Yes. Clayton at Claire. Claire, who's on uh, Clayton's design team, has created an English country garden. So it does show that you can adapt these dyes in very many different ways and get some stunning results. Absolutely beautiful. I do have one or two more samples here with me as well. I adore these little cards that I've got. How sweet are these? So nice. Look at that. Beautiful, absolutely beautiful. Now, if you're looking at the one day special, we've got the details there for you. A £14.70 saving, just 46 97 645610. Now, that's if you're not a Freedom member, you're getting that £10 saving. But if you're a Freedom member, you're getting extra because £14.70 pence is your saving. We can split the cost as well. We can offer this on a flexi for you. So, two payments of £21.14. pence. But don't just check out yet yeah, just hang hang on there because we've got another option for you now the next item we're going to look at we've got the nested circles now i'm going to show you a lovely sample here now you can see the nested circles there you've got that beautiful stitch work there there's 28 dies it's not just the circles you've got the corners there as well and if you're thinking reads and i'm going to bring in this beautiful beautiful sample let me just get this a particular way out. Let me just pop this in so you can see it. How wonderful is this? Using, of course, the dies from the One Day Special. If I just turn this around, you can see how the rings have been used, those circles have been used. So that's the basis to your wreath. If you wanted to go for the collection, so it's all of the new dies, the flowers, the leaves, and the circles together, we're going to give you another £8 saving on top of the saving we've already mentioned. That would mean you've got 57 dies in total. Really big dies there with the circles as well. There's so much you can achieve with those. So perfect for your wreath making, perfect for your shape cars, perfect for your apertures. You've got so much to go with. And of course, you've got those tropical flowers and leaves, which are absolutely stunning. 288-885 is the item number if you're going for the big collection. And once again, we've got that flexi for you as well. So anything else that you're popping into your basket, you can also split the cost. Now, I think we're going to go straight over to Clayton for demonstration so we can really see you know how versatile these dyes actually are so Kleina if we may pass over to you that would be wonderful yeah sure um, 
some of you may have had um, one of my previous releases because uh, initially I came out with some English flowers, um, you know, your, your um, garden flowers. And then the second release um, I did um, like Christmas flowers and foliage. Oh, so wonderful. You, you may have one of those or have seen them before. But if not, the idea behind the Bloom and Anson range is that all of the flowers and leaves have either got a hole in the centre or they've got a a hole just at the end of the stem. And what that means is you can pop a brad through because I used to have trouble with flower arrangements on cards and I would really admire other people's cards that had beautiful flower arrangements on them. And I wanted to find a way that I could kind of achieve it qu quick and easily. So you just pop a brad in and then you pop all of your flowers on, starting from your small ones at the front, going bigger at the back. And then you pop your brad in. Don't tighten your brad too... too um, too tightly but then you can <laughs> my dad says dial in your design <laughs> so you can spin them around to your heart's content that's a good idea spin them around you can make corners you can do um you know yeah. curves full reads um but it's all because we've got this these holes these eyelets at the that end it is very clever so um yeah so you can you can swivel your designs around and then when you're happy you just tighten the brad and then you can pop it on your card literally with one glue dot if you Amazing. want. Amazing. So that's the idea behind it. Now, this does seem like I'm jumping in at the deep end, but we're going to be putting a wreath together. Um, but I want to show you how easy it is, because I really want to um, stress that, that it's, there's a lot of elements. There's a bit of die cutting. Um, but, you know, you can die cut them one day, maybe. Of course. You know, yeah, make build a wreath another day. In lots of different colours as well. So behind um, my wreath, I like to have something to stabilise it. So um, I've cut um, a ring out of my nested dies. Now I've put a couple, of, um, a couple of pieces together. And then I've got a piece here. So there's two ways of hanging it, really. You can either use one of the tag creators that okay. are in the nested circles. And that puts a little hole there that's got the, the um, stitch detail around as well. Or, like on this one, I'm going to be using one of the wall hangers and that's from the um, Take a Stand set. Oh, that's on we the do show have today. that available So as not well. only do you get two different stands in there and a couple of um, um, cup label shapes, um, but you also get your wall hanger. So I'm going to use that, and I'm just going to pop that on now so I can set it aside to dry. Now you've okay. got a fold line about three quarters of the way down. Lovely. So now we have got the details on the screen for Take a Stand. This has been a very popular set in the past as well. It really is very decorative. So you can see there you can create the stands for your cards and your projects. You've got the wall hanger in there as well. You do have some wording in there. We'll see these, I'm sure, a little bit closer. We've got homemade and handmade with love as the wording there. So you can really personalise your projects as well. Just gives it that professional and perfect finishing touch, doesn't it? 168851 is the item number. Great buy at 19.99 as well if you've missed out before go for that one as well because you will not regret it that will work so beautifully with every one of your projects the stands are really handy for putting on your home decor projects or even behind like a gatefold yeah, card definitely because you know how they tend to fall over um so yeah that's how i started using them so all you do is you fold along your score line and only put glue below that score line and then you're you're kind of free to hang it on a wall wonderful Okay, so I'm going to set that aside to dry. Now on with the wreath. Now, uh, this, this is literally how simple it is to do, say, a corner embellishment. But then what we're going to do is we're going to link them together to make a wreath. Okay. But it's the same process. So you just want to get um, your brad. Now, these are colour brads. They're 8 mil across, so they're the large ones. But don't worry, if you can't find them, just use normal paper fasteners, yeah. the, the gold ones. And in every pack, I always put some little discs to cover your brads up. So if you want to use the old ones that you've got in your stash that you don't like the colour of, you could use them and cover them up. I suppose as well, Clayne, if we didn't have any brads, I bet we could make some sort of little clip with a piece of wire, a little bit of florist wire or um, jewellery wire perhaps. Yeah. And make a loop on but the paper two. fasteners, yeah. the gold ones, are in all the supermarkets and they're are everywhere. They? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Or you can get hold of everything. In and they're really inexpensive. And the other thing is the... Um, the legs on it are longer on the gold ones as well. So um, you could get a lot more, you can get a lot more flowers on your, on your uh, brad with those. Okay, so I've started with my small pieces. 
and here I'm, I'm doing um, a passion flower uh, wreath. So what I'm doing also, I just wanted to point out, I'm, I'm doing a wreath with just one pack and I'll be doing that for the first three shows. So each show is gonna start with a wreath that's just made with one of the one day special packs. So this is the, okay. the passion flower one. So I've put my little, my two little stamen pieces on first because they're the smallest because we're kind of starting from small going bigger. Kleina, could you just tilt that towards our camera that's, so we can see that? Because that is so pretty. There we are. We can see exactly, oops. There yeah. we are. We can see exactly what you're doing. So you get two passion flowers of these funny little stamen things. Yeah. Um, so I'm popping them in and then you've got these, um, really, really fine. You might have to put that through, twist it in your, your die cutting machine and put it through again. Okay. It's ever so fine, it's so worth the trouble. And then we're on with the next bit. Now that's all of the pieces for the passion flower. And then that is, I'm that gonna- That is very easy and it's a beautiful flower of passion flower. And you can see straight away that's what it is. <laughs> Thank you. Um, okay, then I'm popping on my passion flower leaf behind it. Then before I put on my big palms, I want to pop in one of my connectors because I want to have an extra, another flower on. So on, on my brad, I'm just going to pop one of these connectors in and then I'm going to put my flower on that later. So now the next step is I want two pounds. These are called fan pounds. I want two of those, add a nice bit of greenery to my wreath. And then I'm adding another connector because you always finish off with a connector when you're doing a wreath. And I'm just going to have that sticking out to the side okay. where I can connect them up. And then I'll do that up for a moment. And of now, course, the so connectors do come with the die sets as well, so they we don't do, need yes. to worry about that. And you get some short ones and some long ones on Amazing. some of the packs as well. Now, where I said I wanted to add an extra flower, so I'm just going to pop another one together. Um, this is a slightly different colourway, but I'm starting with my brad, starting with these two small uh, stamen. Okay then into that very fine, those very fine kind of petals. And then into my uh, back petals. And then I'm gonna add my passion flower leaf on. Okay, so that's my little flower there. And then I'm gonna connect that onto that connector there. This really is very clever. Okay, so here, we, here we've got the two flowers and we've got a connector here sticking out so we can put them all together yeah perfect okay so now all we need to do i've done that's uh, my tenth so i've done ten of these so all we need to do now is turn them over and connect them so this is um literally it takes moments to put a wreath together once you're at that stage so all I'm doing is opening the brad on the previous one and connecting it into the next one. And this is coming together really quickly now, Clay. And once you've you done know, the die cutting, you start connecting. It I, I would hate for anyone to think that it was difficult to do because this really is. I mean, it take, to be honest, it takes a little bit of time to do your die cutting. But once that's done, they come together yeah, so quickly. They do. Do you know, I really can see themed garden parties or, you know, if you're having a dinner party. If you're still not able to go abroad, of course, make sure that you do sort of celebrate at home in your garden, celebrate the summer. I can imagine these, you know, you could put little wreaths around glasses. You could put individual ones on place names, maybe um, invitations you're sending out as well, perhaps. You know, put these onto your bunting, make banners. It doesn't have to be a wreath. It really is absolutely endless what you can achieve with these. That's right. And the lay, of course, if you're having a, if you're having a garden party, <laughs> make some lays. Yes, of course. Do you know, I was very tempted to wear this, but I thought it might interfere with my microphone. It would It's absolutely beautiful. <laughs> can I put it on? I'm being told, wear it, wear it. Oh, I feel like I'm being crowned. There you go. Oh, yeah, look. You know, that is a lovely touch though, isn't it? And also, you know, children dress up yeah. and, um, you know, book days at school and that sort of thing as well. Oh, I'm being told to leave it on. Try not to rustle it against my microphone. Right, okay, now when it comes to the one day special, over 10% of the stock has gone. We're getting very, very busy. I absolutely love this idea, actually. And you could alternate the colours as well. 
while I'm here as well and I'm wearing this, I'm just going to show you the inspiration on the back of the packaging you know, of the dies as well, because you do have some ideas there. I absolutely love that passion flower. It looks so realistic as well. You can see the different layers in there. Of course, you've got the bird of paradise, the lobster claw, the banana leaf there. Uh, gorgeous. I mean, I think you'll start playing with these as well and find other ways of working with them, creating maybe some fantasy flowers as well. This is the passion flower that we could see in currently being put together by Kleiner. Again, a beautiful wreath there, but you've, we've heard how you can make corners, you can make banners, you can do whatever you wish with these. And then next we've got, of course, the hibiscus and the flamingo flowers and the Swiss cheese leaf. I love that Swiss cheese leaf. I think that is so, so nice. When I look at that as well, I imagine using these in jungle themes, you know, the leaves with monkeys and um, all sorts of cute creatures peering out from behind them as well. 645610 is the item number. £10 saving, unless you're a Freedom member, your saving is £14.70. We can split it. So today, all you need to pay is £21.14. 645610. Let's get back to Clay to see how she's getting on okay so they're all linked together and what I'm doing now is oh, was a bit off-center <laughs> are you using foam or dots there Kleiner pardon are you using dots or oh, is it foam you're putting on there I'm just putting a glue dot a glue dot behind each brad and then that's basically what's going to hold our, our circle. Okay. Which um, makes it a bit, a bit more sturdy and gives us something to hang out with. So yeah, at the beginning of each show, uh, the f these first three shows, I'm going to be doing a wreath with just one of the packs. So okay. this yeah. wreath, when you see it, this is just the passion flower pack. And it looks so beautiful. If you can imagine then, if you were to mix in some of the dyes from the other packs, you can imagine how many combinations you could make. Yeah. Okay, one more to go. Very easy to, you're gonna have a lot of fun with this as well. So I'm just gonna try my best to make sure that's circular. And then Make sure that that's covering all my brads. I've got okay. right, now I've got we can see how useful that hanger is there as well. Get out. Know. Okay. Obviously, if you're doing it at home, you could take a bit more time, and I can titivate a little bit between shows. But I'd, I would just tuck them behind. Okay. But for now, I will just. Oops. Turn it over oh, and show isn't that you. beautiful? As well. I love the colours. They're proper passion flower colours as now, well. Now, obviously, Stunning. when you're putting it together, it's kind of on a flat surface, everything yeah. gets flattened. So at this point, then, what I do is I go around and I'll ruffle, um, the, you know, the stamens or the flowers and add some shape in and get it looking more dimensional. Gorgeous. Absolutely gorgeous. And remember, that's just one of the die sets that's been used there. You can see how quickly that came together. Yes, I know you've got to die cut those elements, but we all, you know, we can do that while we're watching TV, listening to the music, chatting to friends or family, do you know, you're going to have so much fun with these. Let's have another look at the details. Now, when it is um, the one day special details, if you add up all the individual dies through the different sets here, we've actually got 29 dies in total. There is that inspiration on the back of the packaging as well. Of course, that's just one idea. You can use these dies individually. You can use them on your boxes, on your bags. It's entirely up to you. All those different varieties are those beautiful tropical flowers and leaves. Item number 645610. Just keep an eye on those savings as well because we have got the collection. I'm going to remind you about the circle dies as well. Now, if you haven't got these, you can get these together. You can go for the full collection. So the dies that we've just seen from the one day special, plus the circle dies as well. And there's so much more you can do with those. It's not just about making the wreaths, of course. Everything together, we're giving you an extra eight pound saving on top of the savings that we've already mentioned. So we're splitting this two ways as well. Two payments of 36 pounds and 98 pence. Item number is 288885. Now we are going to continue down the counter. We're going to have a look at one or two other items as well. Now the next item is our containers. Now this is lovely. You've got jugs there. You can see there's a, a trough almost. You've got jars, you've got pots, you've got all sorts of wonderful things. You've got a gardening glove, you've got the um, secateurs there 
there as well. You've got a whole host of goodies in this one, so you can build up those scenes, build up those arrangements. And actually, this works very, very well with today's one day special as well, because of course, you could use the hibiscus or any of the tropical flowers as well. How pretty is this one as well? Absolutely beautiful. There's a layer of vellum, I believe, on the top here as well that's been embossed so it's very very delicate but so pretty there you can see the swiss cheese leaf in there as well which is my favorite element i just love that 19.99 if you want to go for this set you've got 14 dies there 390543 now next we've got some essentials for you and this is a whole mix let's have a look at these mix them dies you've got essentials one and two you've also got some stamps as well so obviously your dies for cutting out those sentiments for your projects lovely to have the stamps to go along with that you've got lots of different sentiments available within these sets as well you will notice that these have been used on many of the samples as well in fact i'm just going to pick up again the card i've just had because mum is on there i have got other samples to show you as well in fact we've got some lovely ones dotted around the studio what a lovely font that is as well you want to go for this set there's a 12 pound saving today just 46 pounds and 97 pence 29 stamps 28 dies as well i'm just going to turn these around so you can really see what you're getting because obviously being dies if you're looking at the dies themselves the words are back to front you've also got the drop shadow on these as well that's what you can achieve here which i absolutely love i really do like that font and then, of course, you've got your stamps as well. Beautiful. There we are. Now, because we've got flexi on a lot of the items as well, don't forget you can split the cost if you're adding in extras. Now, we have got more as well. Let's take us down. We did mention this as well. I'm going to show you how this has been used in some of the samples as well. We have got other items on the website as well. In fact, I hope we get to show you the rosettes again. But this particular set here, we've got five dies in total. These are very, very decorative. If I just bring in or show you the back of this sample here, we'll come and have a look at this in a second. You'll see how the stands actually work. So you've got lovely detail in there. You can, of course, fold on the embossed line. You can fold this flat for posting. There's the handmade with love, which is included, which I also love because it looks like it's been stitched. Beautiful. Uh, I'm going to show you the front of this as well, just because we do have the rosettes on. We're coming back to those in a second. But another one made by Claire here as well, using the handmade sign in the stands. And if I turn around the sample that we've got at the front of the counter, you can see another stand has been used there. That's also where you're going to find the hanger that, that Clay and I use on the back of the wreath as well. Now, we'll give you the item number for that one, just 19.99 for that set, 168851. Now, we do have more flowers as well, so if you did miss out previously, here we've got the floral collection for you. Oh, this is nice. Add these to your wreaths as well. I love that fern leaf I can see there as well. You've got the connectors in there as well. Some beautiful flowers and leaves. Look at the detail in these, beautiful. You've got the sort of the sprigs of flowers there. There could be gypsophilia, they could be whatever you want them to be. In fact, 782344 is the item number. Uh, we've got a saving on that one as well, £10 saving and another flexi buy. So we really are spreading the cost, aren't we? Now, I did mention as well the rosettes. I have seen these before, but I absolutely love these. I think these are brilliant. In total, in the collection, you are getting 28 dies. We've got some beautiful samples here. Absolutely stunning. I mean, new baby. I don't know if we can see that at the moment. We're just looking at the dies, but I'm going to show you the sample with the new baby, which is beautiful. If you wanted to put your ages or names in there, you can do as well. Uh, again, rosettes for your, for your gift boxes, for your gift bags. Absolutely beautiful. This one's been put in a frame. That's a gorgeous keepsake, isn't it? You have got the wording in there. I can see, if I can read back to the front, because obviously they're dies. We have got the birthday boy, birthday girl in there. Happy birthday, number one is there, best ever, and world's greatest. So a really lovely selection of centres for those beautiful rosettes as well. Now, in one of the other sets, we've got first, we've got second, we've got third, we've got winner, we've got champion, we've got reserve in there as well. That's the set where you're going to create, of course, the beautiful um, ruffled edge to it. You know, that rosette type style edge. You've got the tails in there as well. You've got the centers. But as a collection, you're getting everything that you need. There you can see the first, second and third. That's a good idea, isn't it? You see, I'm, I'm thinking again about these times we get outside. If you've got games on the lawn, you know, I love my space opera. Yeah, I'd be having space opera races. I'd be the winner. That would be me. That's my rosette. <laughs> 
but they're great fun aren't they great for badges for your cars for your children's parties again banners just a lovely collection 59 pounds and 97 pence you've got a 15 pound saving item number 428672 next we've got for you as well oh now this is nice let's bring the details up for the next item uh, we have got Actually, we have had a sneaky peek of this one because I did show you the card with mum on. This is where you will find mum because in this set here, I can see we've got more mix -ums for you. Or one of them is just going to try and sneak away. I'm just going to turn these around so you can see the wording there. So you've got, oh, these are good actually because you've got mum, dad, sister, brother, daughter and son. We've also got grand, mother, father, cousin, uncle, aunties in there as well. And then of course we've got more of the stamps there which are really, really useful. 874258 is the item number there. And again, we've got another flexi for you, two payments of 19.99. Let's head back to Claney though. We want to see more of these wonderful flowers and leaves from the one day special, don't we? Back to you, Claney. Oh, sorry. You oh, sorry. Me. Are you okay there? <laughs> you got me. Right. Okay. So we'll just put a card together. And on this one, what I've done is I have. Um, if you've got any Lincolns. Oh, yes, home. I remember the Lincolns. You can obviously spell your own sentiments out. So okay. I wanted um, a couple of cards, a sample I've made where I've put a lower on. Okay. And on yep. this one, I wanted to put wish you were here. So I'm just going to pop my panel onto my card. You're working with the most beautiful colours, Claner. The bright colours, obviously, with the tropical flower theme, it works yeah. so well. It's got to be done, hasn't it? Yeah. Okay, and um, what I've done is I've picked out a selection of foliage and, and flowers, and I just wanted some nice bright colours. Let's see if I've got a bull tool in here. Oh, I use the end of my paintbrush. Okay. Ah, I've, you're going to do a little bit of shaping. Yeah, I've, I've done it with two of the flowers, but I just want to do it with the last one. So all I'm going to do is I'm going to round the petals backwards. Okay, round any cylindrical item. I mean, obviously, I'm using a paintbrush, <laughs> you know. Um, and then I'm just going to poke it down into a foam mat. Or if, or if you've not got a foam mat, use a mouse mat, you know, anything like that. Um, there, so I'm just going to curl these a bit more. And it's well worth taking the time to do this, isn't it, Clayton? Because it does make a difference when you shape the flowers. Yeah, and it doesn't take long. Love this stuff. And I also like to add a little bit into my leaves as well. Oops. I don't need that anymore. Is this the banana leaf? That you've so got this there? is the banana leaf. Yeah. Um, I don't know if you can see it very well on this one. It's very dark, but there's actually some um, embossed lines on it. Um, so with one of my demos that, I, um, that I'll do in, um, in the next show, probably, um, I actually swipe a... Uh, it's a lighter green. Okay. When I swipe the ink pad over it, all of the embossed lines show up. It's great. And then... We could actually see the lines in there, Clay, no? Oh, great. Yeah. Yeah, all of the foliage has got some. I don't know if you can see it in that one. If you hold it really still, oh yes we can, look at that. Yeah, there's so lots of detail in there, love so it. So if you, if you, um, yeah, swipe an ink pad over them, you'll get, you'll get some, um, they'll really show up. Now with the leaf that you've just done there, I can see you curling both ways, so that gives it more of a natural look as well. Some good to curl in one way, some curl in the other. <laughs> yeah, I like to do that. Okay, so I've just uh, given everything a little bit of shape. There's no like real rhyme or reason to it. Okay, okay. okay so I'm going to start. Now, the way my sentiment is, I, I did think my sentiment would be further over in the corner, but um, then I thought, okay, so I, rather than just a corner display, I want it to be a little bit up here and then more sweeping down across oh, the nice. bottom of my card here. Yeah. So I'm going to work with my corner flower. Okay. I'm going to go with a yellow. Then the hibiscus have got these little 
these little funny, they've got a funny little stamen. I love this because they're beautiful flowers. So I'm going to pop that on first and then into my hibiscus. And then really, I just want to think about the way I want my design. So, um, so I'll just have a quick, uh, maybe that one there. Um, maybe I'll do a flower. Okay, so wherever I put another flower, I'll need a connector. Um, so yeah, I think that I think that looks good. I think that's going to work perfectly. Okay, so if I want another flower in there, I'm going to pop in. I want it to be quite close, so I'm going to pop in a small connector because you do get some shorter runs, and then I'll start adding on this foliage. Okay. I love the, the fact that you've got leaf. different lengths of connectors. It makes so much sense, and it's such a clever idea, but it, it really works so well, Kleiner. Thank you. <laughs> and then for my other flower, I want it going in that direction. But don't worry about your direction, because as long as you don't pinch on your um, brad too tightly, you, you can arrange them afterwards. Okay, and I'll put that one in just to fill that gap a bit. Okay, that's looking about right. Lovely stuff. Okay, so now all I need to do now, remember my little stamen, I need to just add my flowers now onto where I pop those connectors in. I think I'll put that up there. Do you know, I think it's an area that a lot of people struggle as well. They cut out beautiful flowers, beautiful leaves. You know, you can have the fronds coming from the back of the flowers and then you come to put them together and you're not sure how to stick them in and once you've stuck them if you don't lay them out first or you move things and then you stick and once your glue's down that's it the, the fact thing that is you, with this you, you can take it apart wonderful. yeah you can take it apart and put it back together yeah. again as many times as you want of because course. there's no glue involved so now is what what i was talking about kind of dial it, dialing it in because it's kind of like you swivel them around if you don't like it, if it's not working, if you think, oh, actually, I could have done with a longer connection there, take it apart, put one in. Exactly, you're not damaging anything doing that. You're just opening up the brad, and that's it. I'm looping everything, and then put it back together in a different way. So I'm quite happy with that. That looks lovely. So let's pop a glue dot on there. I love the fact that you only need a small amount of glue or a glue dot because you've got those all connected together. What I I do tend to do, in all honesty, is I tend to do use one and then when I'm happy and I kind of do titivate a little bit and then I come, I come along behind with a little bit of wet glue okay. and just put yeah. a couple of dots behind. Um, but once I'm fully happy. Love it. So there you are. You can send someone, if you do manage to go on holiday, you can send someone a card and say, wish you were here and make them really jealous. That is so pretty. It really, really is. Oh, thank you, Kleiner. Another bit of a recap. Let's have another look at the one day special itself. Of course, almost 20% of the stock has gone. If you do become a Freedom member, of course, your saving is bigger. You're getting a £14.70 saving there, which really isn't worth turning your nose up at, is it? Love it. Absolutely love it because you've got the tropical feel here. You can work with those bright colours. You've got those different leaves in there. I'm sure you're going to find different ways of adapting these as well. Just watching Kleiner then, I did think, how much fun would it be if you made a spray of flowers for someone on a card and put a little note inside and said please feel free to make your own flower arrangement you could have let them sort of arrange them themselves if you didn't glue them all down because you've already got that connector in there now we've got various different flowers and foliage here in fact there's nine different flowers and leaves in total let's have a look again we've got the bird of paradise We've got the lobster claw and we've got the banana leaf in there. So if you want that height, that banana leaf, as we've just seen, works very, very well. The bird of paradise is beautiful as well. Next one along, we are going to see the passion flower and, of course, the leaf that goes with it and the fan palm as well. This is the first demonstration. If you did see it, then you will be looking at this particular die set. If you didn't see it, you can catch that on Rewind and I'm sure we'll show you the sample again, but it's absolutely beautiful. And then finally, in the one day special, our third set is this one, which is is the hibiscus we've got the flamingo flower and we've got the swiss cheese leaf great as well if you are making those jungle scenes as well
Now, if you do want to make the wreaths and you don't have the circle die, we can offer that one for you as well. But we can also offer you that complete collection. So any savings that you've already been given on the one day special will carry over. On top of that, we're going to give you another eight pounds, bringing the total to 73.96. We have got flexi on this as well. You are getting 57 dies there. Those circle dies as well. Was it 28 just in that one set? I believe it might. It was 28 dies just in the circles there. 288885 is the item number. If you're going for the big collection, of course. Now, also, we're busy for the containers as well. Do like this. You've got lots of options here. You know, you've got the little trough there. You've got the wood grain if you want to use it. You've got the jug. You've got pots. You could have little pails there. You've got milk bottles. You know, you've got all sorts. I love little heart is in there. And I did notice as well that on some of the little cards used with the tropical flowers, that heart had been used, and it looked really effective. But just turn this around so you can see the back of the packaging again. That makes a lot of sense. Do you know, look at that. So the two little pots will fit into the trough as well. Well, oh, I love that. Do you know, I bet you could turn some of these flowers into herbs as well. You could turn those into herbs. I'm thinking of the show last night. We had herbs on in the gardening show, and it was lovely in a little trough like that. You've got the gardening gloves as well. I love the little heart in there as an addition to your uh, different utensils, so to speak. There you can see we've got a lovely sample in front again as well. 390543 is the item number if you want to go for this one. Only 19.99. Now we have mentioned this flexi on so many of the options tonight, including the one day special. If you're not sure how that works, we're going to remind you right now. What is flexi order? When you place an item on FlexiBuy in your basket, you qualify for Flexi Order, which means any other items you add to your basket will also be included in your FlexiBuy payments. So you can spread the cost over multiple monthly payments. After your first payment is made, your entire order will be dispatched. When you add at least £60 worth of any items to your shopping basket, either online or on the phone, you'll qualify for our Flexi Order offer. This means you can spread the cost of your order over equal monthly Flexi Buy payments, offering you extra flexibility when you shop with us. Flexi Order, making your shopping experience with the craft store easier. Oh, there we go. It does make it easy. I just wanted to show you another little sample we've got here as well. How sweet is this box? Do you know, using, again, the hibiscus, and that's a layer of vellum again there. So delicate, so pretty, with the Swiss cheese plant uh, leaf there as well. Absolutely beautiful. And I don't think, I did show this one earlier, so I just want to bring it in. I'm going to show you this one on the other side as well. Bird of Paradise. They are the most beautiful flowers, aren't they? And on the back, if I just turn this around, you can see we've got one of the stands and the handmade with love, which is available in a different set as well, but absolutely beautiful. If you're looking at the one day special, we've got the details there for you, 645610. Do become a Freedom member because your saving is £14.70. Now, hopefully, we can see more demonstrations from Kleiner. I wonder what she's going to show us next. Hmm, shall we have a wander over there? Okay. Let's cut up some some leaves. So I've got one of the fan palms here. Okay. And I'm just going to take the stem off. Because what I'm hoping to do is show you different ways that you can use them. So we've seen them in a wreath and we've seen them as an embellishment on the front of your card. And now, I want to use them as a stencil. Jill Kleiner, I can imagine those leaves just stuck down onto a piece of card as a background as well. It would be yeah. really, yeah. really it's, effective. Um, it's kind of tricky to kind of think of, um, you know, just how, how will I use them. So um, I have actually got one prepared, but I just wanted to just show you how I, how I did this. And okay. it wasn't... Um, I just held it on my fingers. I didn't worry about putting any... Um, spray on them or anything and just work from the inside out oh look at and that and just did a little bit of um just a little bit of color i like that and then you know on that card you the, the tag you showed earlier on where yes um, one of them yeah. is just using the waist piece yeah it's, it was kind of almost that idea 
We'll show that again in a little while. It's really effective. Okay, oh, so I've done like a couple that a of that one. And then I want to come in with the Swiss cheese one. And I want to kind of layer that on top. Oh, wow. So you can actually see, see you, it. You expect you to move that leaf there and you think, yeah. oh, that's ink on ink. We're not going to see much, but it really makes an impact. And I think on my, on my um, the one I prepared earlier, I did actually use two different shades of green as well. Um, but actually, it's showing up fine. With that looks the same. really, really effective. But there, so what I would do then is I would trim that down afterwards. So do a larger piece than you would, than you would think. Okay. Because when you, when you trim them down, you can kind of pick the piece that you like the best then and trim away. And I think it looks a bit more natural as well when you trim away some of the, yeah. some of the sides. So what I've done is I've got mine here that I prepared before. And you can see that I, I did actually use two different shades oh, of green. there's a bit of blue in there, isn't there? Yeah, it was, um, I think That's it was lovely. pine needles and mowed lawn, I think. Wonderful. Okay, so what I want to do is I want to do, um, build just foliage on foliage. So I'm just going to do, pop a few um, little leaves together. Okay. So this hasn't got, it's kind of a little bit monochromatic, I suppose. Uh, so I, um, but again, I think I'll just lay them out, um, get a sense of where I want to go. I want it to be kind of diagonal. So I'll have that one there. And then what I've done with the small connectors, this is a perfect example of what you can do with them. You can actually glue them onto your ah. small pieces. And because sometimes when I'm designing the kits, I think, oh, should I put two in? Like when I was doing the passion flower, um, no, the Bird of Paradise. Yeah. I was thinking, oh, it would be nice to have two different lengths. But, of course, all you need to do is glue one of the little connectors exactly. on and yeah, extend I've it. Never so, it's, that so it's an extender now as well. Wonderful. So if I put that one down here, I think. Kleiner, would your dyes cut through a, a fine fabric, do you think? Have you used a chiffon or something quite... Quite thin, would it work? I would, I would take one of the bold, bolder shapes. Um, I, these um, particularly delicate ones, a bit of a challenge a on thick card. I had to kind of yeah. rein in the the GSM on the card a bit because I, you know, they are. I do tend to put a lot of detail on the dies. Now on this one, I'm using one of the colours that I wouldn't normally use, the brads, because it's going to be fully covered up. Okay. So use them up when you can. Actually, that's a good point because I, I should imagine lots of us have got brads, jars of brads, you know, and we don't like the colour or they've got a design on yeah. that we don't particularly want to use. But yeah, if you're not going to see it, it doesn't matter, does it? Yeah, cover it up. Okay, and again, I'll, I'll um, tighten my brad part way. And then I'll try and work out. There, I'll tighten it. I think. I think I'm kind okay, of happy with that. Lovely stuff. Okay, so I can pop a glue dot behind that. Pop it down. I do love your style, Kleiner, because to me it's it's what's that? How can I put it? I was going to say it's unfussy, but it's not unfussy, and that doesn't make sense, does it? Because it's kind of a contradiction. But I think it's because you're working with the beautiful colours, you've got the detail in the shapes there, but there's nothing sort of gone overboard oh, with you. the that's designs. Really, that's there. really nice. But I, I know I do tend to err towards a, like a clean and simple yeah. style myself. I admire so much other people's work that isn't, but I just can't seem to make myself do it. It's um, really strange, so actually, because I talk to a lot of guests about this and yeah. there's guests that, you know, seem to be able to have to just keep piling on and don't like white space and, they, you know, they, they overload, in a sense, and they admit that themselves. And then there's other people that really keep it stripped back. I actually think it is harder to strip it back, in a sense. But when we see beautiful samples like this, you think, well, 
yeah, I can do this. I've got the tools, I've got the appropriate tools. The fact that Clay has come up with a design like this with the connectors as well, which allows you to create those different displays. It is very, very clever. It sounds like a simple concept, but actually nobody, I don't think, has thought of it before. I've not seen it before. And it, it works. It really does work. It makes the job easy. You can change things if you're not happy with it. You're not using so much glue as well. So in the long run, it's going to save you money. I just love it. I do try my best to come out with um, new, new ideas, new products, things that haven't been done, maybe, you know, and it's funny because, um, you know, I do often hear, why hasn't anyone done that before? Yeah. You know? Because some things are a bit... Now, you're using... Is this from the Essentials kit, Plainer, the, the wording that you've got there? Yes, I believe it is. I'm not sure which one. I think there's two in the Essentials kit, isn't there? Yeah, we've, we've, got, uh, we've got some on the counter. I believe it's one on the counter. Yes, it is. We can see it there. I believe there it is. So you've got Thinking of You, Hello, Friend, Thank is in there as well. Thanks is in there. Best wishes. We've got Happy Birthday, Congratulations, With Love, Ah, now I get it. You've got thank and thanks. So you've got thank you. You yes. have to put them together. Wonderful. So you can change these around a little bit. Because all the words are separate, which yeah. means you can mix and match them. So the you also goes with thinking of you, love you, you know, things yeah. like that. Hello, yeah. you. So, yeah, yeah I, I, I don't bring you the words more than once. I remember um, I was asked to design um, a, a kit for someone. Um, for the market, the craft market. And um, I realized in the kit that I was asked to produce, it had the word Christmas in it four times. Ah. And I just thought, if ever I do it, I'll make sure that people only have yeah. to buy that dye for yeah. me once, yeah. you know? Yeah. Oh, it's a really good point. So we know we, you know, we're getting value for money because we've got different words in there. You do also get the stamps in that collection as well. We did show that very, in fact, it's there again. Look, make a wish. You've got all sorts of words that will fit together. Let's celebrate. You are a true, and then of course you can add on with a different word. You make me so, and again, you've got the words you can add on. So another really versatile set here. Smile, it's your, so it could be birthday. There'll be other things in there as well. Oh, we've got happy news in there. What a lovely set. Oh, it's worth mentioning. I have PDFs um, in my group with all the different variations I thought of oh, when dear. I was designing them. Oh, oh, that's handy. Oh, there's also there's also a PDF to help with um, the Bloom and Anson range as well. Is there? Yeah. Oh, wonderful. So, yeah, there's a couple of downloads there in my group if anyone wants to... Oh, that's nice to know. ...wants to get those. Oh, thanks for that, Kleiner. Now, just as we're watching the foam pads gone the back there, I'm going to let everybody know when it comes to the one day special, we're approaching quarter of the stock gone. This is the first live hour. Clayton, of course, will be back at eight o'clock. In fact, we're back together again. We've not seen each other for ages and we've got two shows together, <laughs> which is wonderful. 645610 is the item number for the one day special and you are getting 29 beautiful dies. Okay, I need to add some more. What, I'm, what I've done, because I've got a brand in the middle, I need to kind of bridge that with the... With the pants. Oh, I see, yes. But yeah. one layer isn't doing it. So I'll, yeah. I'll just pop another layer on. Yeah, you don't want a little bump in the centre of the sentiment. But it's great because it's, you know, it's sitting there holding itself. and Lovely stuff. Did I notice we'd got foam tape as a seven-day saver? Was it a seven-day saver I saw earlier? One big roll of it. Oh, I've bought that. Yeah, I've heard. Is it the Walther one? Yeah. Oh, it is. We've just checked. We've just checked. So if you do want your foam tape, of course, if you're creating what you can see Kleiner doing here as well, we have got that. We'll just show this actually because this is a huge roll. 40 metres is what you're getting here for £9.99, a £9 saving. This is a centimetre in width and millimetres in depth is two. Three. Oh, three mil. Even better. 893 518 is the item number if you want to go for that. Stock up if you're going for the one day special and all of Kleiner's beautiful, beautiful designs here because you will be using that. That is coming together perfectly. Well, well that's it pretty much done. I mean, you can love then, oh, I love it. you know, shape your flowers, but it's, it's, I love everything about that plane. <laughs> I love the background. Again, the colours of those beautiful leaves. The sentiment looks perfect. It's just clean, crisp and perfect. So, and if you, I think if you put them kind of with, oh, I bet this is going to stick now. 
you know, it's um, yeah, the same. Three completely different you know. samples there. Very versatile set we've got here for you tonight. Absolutely gorgeous. Oh, this is an excuse to get all those beautiful bright papers out, isn't it, as well? Now, we will have about five minutes left, Kleiner, when I've done another recap. Is there anything very quickly we could show, do you think? I've got something extremely quick. Have you? Oh, perfect. We'll have a quick reminder, then we'll be back with Kleiner then. Now, a quarter of the stock of the one-day special is now gone. As I give the details again, if I may, I'm going to show you one or two more samples again, just so you can see. Uh, so, remember, if you're a Freedom member, you've got the biggest saving. You've got £14.70 off the price here. If you're not a Freedom member, you're still saving £10 pounds absolutely beautiful i love these little cars these are made by hannah look at that that's that little heart i was referring to in our uh, containers set as well really versatile love 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 everything about these flowers and the leaves of course oh i can't go without showing you the passion flower again there it is beautiful absolutely stunning 645610 is the item number do think about the garden parties that you might be having again i'm going to bring in that wreath again that uh, i've got the back here because just to show you we have also i'm saying we um cleaners use of course the circles in this as well you can put a hole in the top and of course we have got the hanger in another set as well the circles are available of course or you can go for the big collection which is the one day special and the set of the circles as well but details still on the screen there if you're going for the one day special with all those leaves those beautiful flowers in fact nine varieties now if you're not sure what freedom is because we are picking up new viewers constantly we do know that so if you're new to us and you don't know what freedom is we're going to tell you about it right now have you heard of freedom did you know that as a freedom member you could be making savings on every order you place for just £7.97 a month, you will benefit from selective Freedom member discounts and complimentary standard delivery on every order you place. You will also receive our exclusive Freedom Members badge, giveaways and crafty updates. If you shop with a craft store more than twice a month, then Freedom is for you. Don't forget, your Freedom membership is flexible, so you can pause if you're going away or you can cancel at any time you decide. So what are you waiting for? Give us a call or go to our website quoting the item number 888888 and join Freedom today. Oh, and of course, if you are new to us here at the channel, that was our lovely Leone. You'll see lots of Leona here. We are going to head back to Clayne because we've got a very quick demo to show you before the end of the hour. I'm looking forward to this one because I've just found out what it is. So <laughs> Clayne, I'm going to hand it back to you. What I thought I'd do, I won't put a whole one together, but I'll give you an idea of how the lay was made. Wonderful. Catherine was wearing. Yeah, oh, you've got different colours in that one. I can see you're going to alternate the colours. Yeah, I put some different shades of pink together. Um, the reason that I was um, sticking with pink is because of what I'm using for my spacers. Now, there's a couple of things you can do. You can um, just roll up strips of cardstock to make just little spacers. Okay. Or if you've got any plastic straws hanging around in your home, this is an ideal way to use them up. Ah. Now, these might go flying everywhere. <laughs> but all you want to do is just snip some some little spaces. So they're like little, they're like bugle beads in a sense, aren't they? Sort of larger versions of uh, bugle beads. Oh, if you can I have some fun with this, can't you? Do a few of them, I should be able to find a few. See what I'd be doing there, Clayton, I'd have a pot in front of me, see how many I can catch in the pot as I cut them. <laughs> that would have been a better idea. <laughs> <laughs> Made a right mess. Right, okay, so a, a, a tip for this as well. Um, which I've not done, is if you've just got some sellotape, put a little bit of sellotape yeah. on the end of your, you know, okay. your doobry what's it. Okay, so all you want to do is you want to start threading um, your flowers. I just curled them as I did before, just a little bit of a curl, and then push down in the middle to give them a little bit of shape. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to put two flowers on, and I'm going to alternate the colours, but I'm going to put them back to back. Ah, yes. Oh, they are pretty, aren't they? Look at them. And then you pop in one of your little pieces of straw or paper coil, whatever it is that you've done. So you're putting it in. This is a great project to let the children get involved with as well because they yeah. can easily thread through, you know, pick the colours out. You could have all the colours of the rainbow on a lay. That would look really nice. Yeah, I mean, I've literally only done pink 
um, because I have pink straws. Um, but not that that matters. You could you could use any color straws if, if you've you know if you've got them hanging around the house. You, it's a good way to use them up. Or indeed, if paper straws would be great as well. So you know, they would even look nice if you've got a bookmark and they were sort of dangling from the, the end of a bookmark so that when they were in the book, you could see how pretty the flowers were just over the edge. So all we're doing for the shape is just bending the petals back a little bit. Okay. But you don't have to stop with the flowers because I was thinking um, the, the back petals on the passion flower, I think that would work great. Actually, you're right. Introducing would, yeah. that into this because that's yeah. kind of a circular design, but it's a bit more spiky. Do you think if you wanted to add one or two of the leaves in there with the smaller connectors, that would work as well? Because you could thread the yeah the cord through the connectors. Yeah, yeah. Do you know? What? I bet that would look really good with some of the cheese. Yes. Front ones yeah. The, yeah, because they're nice and sturdy, aren't they? Oh, I want to. I want to. Garden party now with all this around the garden. I think it looks well, so Well, this is so it. We're pretty. all looking forward to, you know, to being able to go on holiday or just be out and about a bit, really. I would so enjoy putting these together. I'd have little, I think I'd, my little jars with the tea light in, I'd have one of these sort of attached as well. So if I just show you that bit there I hope you oh, wow, oh, I put it against my top. that's probably better isn't it so I hope you can get an idea of how that comes together but yeah add different colors like you say it. add some foliage in that actually is a great project if you've got a children's party and you want you know make let them make their own have a little bit of a crafting party that would be absolutely ideal they can choose the colors and then they've got something to to take home with them at the end of it I think that's yeah. fabulous that's a oh, great Kleiner, idea you've given us four wonderful demonstrations there we are back together at eight o'clock so yeah. i'm looking forward to that make sure you check your baskets out uh, very very different absolutely beautiful those tropical flowers there the leaves that go with them as well don't forget we do have the circles if you're going for the bigger collection we've got lots of other goodies available as well lots with flexi buy on them as well so do have a look at those Kleiner, thank you once again i thank shall you. see you in a, an everyone. hour or so but don't you go anywhere we've got much more 